Hello, Inspajoyers, it's me. Oh man, um, welcome back. So today I am going to keep it super brief for you. So, but I because I want you to stay till the very end because there is something that I want to challenge you on at the end. So stay till the end. Today I want to talk about friendships and encouragement. And the reason why I wanted to talk about that is because I have been so super, super blessed to have two different groups of friends that are tried and true friends. I have plenty of acquaintances and plenty of people that are friends, but then there are those absolute like push you and encourage you type of friends, right? That you do life with, you're in the trenches with. One are my yayas. Hello, yayas. Um, I've been friends with them since high school and we've just stayed in contact this whole time through messenger phone, whatever the case may be. You know, we laugh at each other. We cry with each other. We get angry with each other. But at the end of the day, we know that there's no judgment, no criticism, no nothing. We're just there to love and encourage each other. And it has been so awesome. My other group of friends are two women that I do life with very, very often. And we just get together either for a cup of coffee or a glass of wine. And now with social distancing, sometimes it's through Zoom. And we just talk about life and we talk about God and we talk about goals and dreams and, you know, just passions and purposes. And, and that has been awesome. And, um, I said all that to say that it is so encouraging to have those people in your life because there is nothing like when you're going through something that's really, really difficult when you are just so down on yourself. And I know that we've all been there and I've been there multiple times recently where I just feel so down, um, not because of everything going on, but just because of different circumstances that have happened in my life where I just feel sad. I feel the sadness, right? And so I'm so lucky and blessed to have friends that can help put a smile on my face and that can remind me of certain things that bring happiness and joy back into my body. And so I really just love the encouragement that comes from those people. And so I thought today, what better thing would there be than to really help encourage other people. And I know I say this in all my videos, right? We need to be an inspo joy for other people. This is not just about us. It's about really serving other people. So today here is my challenge. First, if you do not have those group of friends that you can lean on, I want to encourage you to find that accountability as soon as possible. I know with social distancing, some people have become a little bit internalized where they don't want to be around anybody. But trust me when I say it is so important to have good friends to lean into, to encourage you to speak truth to you and you're not always gonna like it and that's okay but you need to have those friendships to speak life into you um, and then secondly and here's the challenge that I really want to put out there and I hope that you will share this video with other people because what I am hoping is that hundreds of people will do this right and here's what I would like I would love it if you would choose three people just three people that you know and I almost would encourage you to pick three people that maybe are not like your closest knit friends, but just people that you have known that you can send an encouraging letter to. Not a messenger, not a text, not an email, but a letter. Put a stamp on an envelope and send them a letter. Because I think more and more these days, we have that expectation of getting a text and we have that expectation of being on social media. But actually rece receiving something tangible where it's handwritten, where somebody has taken the time to do that for you to encourage you is almost like, it's almost a thing of the past. So I really want to challenge you guys to do that. Pick three people to send a letter to. And here's the second part of that challenge. If you decide that you want to do this, and I hope that you will, because you're going to encourage so many people out there and you don't even have to just limit it to three. You can send as many as you want, but do at least three people. And if you do it, what I would like for you to do is to post a picture of yourself holding the three envelopes, please cover their personal information because we do not want to share that with social media. But if you would post a picture of you holding the envelopes, if you don't like selfies, it's all good. Just post a picture of your actual um, envelopes covering the personal information again. Um, post a picture of that because at the end of this whole thing, which I'm going to extend to June, or extend, I didn't even give you a date. Um, I want to do the deadline June 16th, uh, June 15th, just to give plenty of people time to pass this video on to other people to share it. Um, and June 15th, I'm going to do a drawing. And that drawing is for whoever has sent out letters. I want to take the time to encourage and motivate you for doing that. And that means that I'm going to be giving away this hundy dundy little journal. It's so cute. And it's a little inspirational journal. And inside, check this out, guys. It's so cute. Let me see if I can do this this way. 
It is filled with a bunch of motivational quotes and then there's page there for you to journal. And I just think it's so sweet. So I just love it. And I wanted to be able to give this to somebody just because they have taken the time out of their day to send those letters out to three people. So I hope that you will join me. I hope that you will share this. And I hope that you will win this wonderful motivational thing because I really want to be able to encourage you as a thank you for encouraging other people. Okay. So that is all I have for you guys today, man. Go out there, get those friendships and stay true to them, man. Make sure that you make the time for those friendships and send the those three letters and don't forget to post the picture that's important I have to see that you post the picture either on Instagram Facebook you don't have to do it on both um, and that way I know and can put you in the drawing and then June 15th I'll be picking somebody for this all right you guys make sure you subscribe to my YouTube take care have an inspired joyful day um, follow me on Facebook you know all the wonderful stuff and June 15th I can't wait I cannot wait to give this away Bye, guys. Have an inspired joyful day. And don't forget, be an inspired joy for someone. Bye.